and here they are. She's very young, very small, 66 pounds, and he throws her around like a rag doll. 14 years old. They may look small and young to everyone, but the Russians know what they're doing, believe me. They're preparing them for the Olympics, I believe. They sure are. The Russians are known for this. They have great depth in their team. It's not just that they have the first place or a second place. They have a third pair or a third single who is a threat. And in fact, in the Paris competition right here, they have a very good chance of capturing all three medals. And here we go. For a triple throw axel. Not quite, almost. He could have thrown it right out of the arena on that one. I think so. <laughs> so tiny. Sixty-six pounds. It's like picking up a feather, I would imagine. I would think so. In fact, it's much easier for him to pick her up. Ooh, look at that. Mm. Much easier for him to pick her up than it would be if she were much heavier. It's a great advantage for them. Is it an unfair advantage? Well, it's difficult to say. She has a right to be small, I guess. That's right. <laughs> She'll grow into a big girl. in unison for such a young couple. One-handed overhead lift. Very difficult move. But of course not when she's so light. Baby doll. There it is. <laughs> the performance of Shakrai and Cherkasova. Very impressive for their first time in the European Championships. They are definitely a promise for the Olympic Games in 1980. Misha, if I tell you what her hobby how her hobbies are, would you would you believe this? I'm not sure. She collects dolls. Oh my god. <laughs> and there are her marks. They're not bad for the first time in international competition, and they look happy. Coming up next, five-time world champions, Adina Rodnina and Alexander Zaitsev, and they are the favorites. 